Well, good Wednesday to everyone out there. We got some heavy rain in store for us as we go through the rest of the morning. Most of the heavy rain should be wrapping up, though, by about 9 a.m. Could see a few lingering showers as we get into the afternoon, but uh, once we get into the overnight hours, rain should be winding down. So here's the future cast. We're starting off at 6 a.m. Again, you see some heavy rain still pushing through uh, portions of the area, the Golden Triangle, West Alabama, uh, but that will quickly push off to the south and east into central Alabama uh, by the time we get to, say, mid-morning. But you see uh, we've got this uh, wraparound low and some lingering showers uh, as we go through the rest of the afternoon. Uh, they're going to be hit or miss. More spots than not going to miss out on rain as we head through the afternoon hours. We dry things out overnight. Temperature's going to be on a range today, anywhere from the low 60s up towards Iuka, Boonville, New Albany, Oxford. Uh, but we could see some 70s in the board once you get into the Golden Triangle area. Uh, West Alabama generally going to be from the upper 60s to lower 70s as we go through the day today. Now, as we head through the next couple of days, we dry out Thursday, but another rain chance on Friday and Saturday uh, as a cold front pushes through. That rain should be ending for us as we head into Sunday. So it looks like Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, going to stay dry and much cooler back behind that front. So here's how the next seven days are going to work out. Again, you see the rain chance in the board. We're going to start off with 80% for the early morning, then drop it back down to 20% today as we head into the afternoon hours. You can see temperatures stay above average as we head through the rest of the work week. Uh, we stay dry temporarily, at least on Thursday, but more rain on Friday. Then that front pushes through. High temperatures only making it into the 50s on Saturday. Pretty good chance of rain Saturday morning and maybe even into Saturday afternoon as well, but ending overnight. Christmas Eve and Christmas Day looking dry and cool with temperatures in the 40s. Overnight lows going to be dropping down into the 20s both Christmas Eve and the uh, overnight on Christmas Day. We'll be back to 50 degrees by the time we get to Tuesday. Chief Meteorologist Keith Gibson will be in tonight. We'll have the latest on your forecast coming up on WCBI News at 5.